Welcome back to Let's Play Nobody Saves the World. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we're here in the Bone Pile in the Shadowlands. Last time I got past the Path of Doom and was given the, uh, and as a result, as a reward, I was allowed to explore the rest of the Shadowlands, which turns out are just as horrible as the rest of it. I mean, there was a chest on the other side of some red water earlier, and I kind of didn't want to check if it was safe. What's that all these little craters? I mean, I call them craters because they're perfectly circle circular, and they've got a bunch of cracks radiating out from them, but they appear to be flush with the ground, which is weird. Well, uh, you guys up here, yes. Hello, follower one. You're finally here. Let's get inside and find all the crystals. I'm sure there will be lots. Come with me. Ancient mine, let's look for those crystals. I can already smell plenty of them in here. Follow me this way. The fuck is that sound? Okay, I can't go in there. Hey, uh, can you go on ahead and see if you can find anything? I... I will cover you from here. You know, in case monsters ambush us. Go on, head inside! Uh, Justin... Uh-oh. Yeah. He was standing right next to a switch, and there was a line of, uh, spike holes on the ground, so I kinda saw this coming. Heh, you fool! You actually believe that there are crystals in this pitiful place? I thought you were pretty smart when you survived my course, but turns out you're actually as dull as a doorknob. Oh, I almost feel bad that things are gonna end this way. I guess I'll never have a chance to tend to your rabbits no more. Heh <laughs> Uh... Oh god, that's why the quest is called Bullet Hell! It's those saw blade things from the, uh, the, the, the wait for it boss fight. I, uh, guess I have to follow the path that isn't made of blades? Because there is a noticeable gap right there. Oh. Oh. No, I can't be the, uh, the horse. It's bigger. Oh, I know. Mouse is still faster. Fuck. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Wait, why am I just not hiding off to the side? Oh, because I need to go up. Ah! Yes. But I wanted to check something first, because I had a shout-out about that. <laughs> shout-out to K.O.R., who says, uh... Well, let's see. Uh, the slimes remind me a lot of the art style of the oatmeal. The music for this area, I believe it was the dungeon with the, uh... The throwy spine guy as the boss. Reminds me a lot of Cackle Tower from Shantae and the Pirate's Curse. And the reason we're looking at my editing program, if you watch in slow motion when you die, there's a rather horrifying image of nobody's screaming face evaporating. So, let's roll that forward. Oh. Oh dear. I had not noticed that in the little explosion, uh, graphics. Hot damn! Well, thanks for bringing that to my attention. Okay, let's give that another shot. Ooh! Actually, uh... Hardened Shell! And since I've got a whole bunch of tokens, let's go ahead and upgrade Hardened Shell so I never lose more than a fifth of my max health from a single hit, considering those things were doing, like, practically 2,000 damage by themselves. Actually, they might have been. Shit. Yay! Ah! Okay. That could have gone worse. Let me guess, there's gonna be another path of them over here. Okay. Oh no!
Oh, it's the fact that they're moving! Oh, this is the second go, though. It's letting me skip the first one. Nice! Ah! No! Am I far enough away to not break those barrels? Fuck. Alright, nobody gets to get some mana. Kick ass! even with that, uh, eggshell ability. Oh! Fuck! I wasn't expecting the, uh, enemies. It's the bug guys from the lake. Yeah, I've missed you too. Also, they're like, uh, I just realized they're three levels higher than me. Hmm. Okay, taking that slightly more seriously, then. Now, unlike my friends over there, you're crap, which means you can't follow me or run away. Sucks to be you! Ah! I forgot to notice when they died. The out uh, guitar, the electric guitar, does seem kind of out of place in this game. Yet it really works. Kind of reminds me of some of the Castlevania game soundtracks in that way. in there. Oh, I have to go down this time. See if you could just run with them, there would be no challenge in it. Hmm. Just trying to think if there would be a benefit to switching to... Oh, but he's slower. I mean, he has way more health, than he does, but... Oh, no, no. I'm misthinking of it. Uh, it's uh, it's no more than a fifth of my health, which is a different number for the bodybuilder than it is for the rat, so I would actually be in it taking roughly the same amount of damage as far as the size of my health bar is concerned. Oh! Right, okay. Uh, I did not expect the water in there. And I guess it's a fucking mermaid's turn. Does she have... Yes, yeah, she does have the, uh, the foot on there. She doesn't have the eggshell. Uh, let's get rid of... <laughs> scavenge. At least for the time being. Maybe she has a quest for that. What's that? Bullet Hell, find the exit to the Ancient Mines Tunnel. Dungeon Dark Tower, clear the Dark Tower Dungeon. Just checking. Oh god. No! Piss drink! Wait. The smallest one of all. Oh, but egg has so little health. I guess it doesn't matter how little health you have for the same reasons as the thing I just mentioned. Ah! Uh. Oh, 
Oh, but he doesn't have the, uh, the speed upgrade on. Oh, but he's still moving at 110, so it doesn't... Wait, no, I think I upgraded that one. Well, he's not going to be dealing any damage, that's for goddamn sure. 130, okay. What? No, I know the ghost won't work. Okay, I'm, I'm overthinking this. I've just got to get in there. Why couldn't I have gotten that one with a fucking... Ah! Uh, it's the water part that fucks me up. No. In fact... Sadly, I can't upgrade to one-sixth uh, of my damage on that ability. Until and unless I, uh, get Rat to S. Because, of course, it doesn't stop at A. Ah, oh, fuck! I thought it was aligned differently. I took all three of those. No! I'm gonna try Ghost. Look at that. There's an empty space I can put the hardened shell in. Arg? Oh. Ethereal! Pass through baddies and their attacks. Uh. Well, it does reduce my movement speed significantly. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Damn it, that almost worked. Wait. Oh fuck, I can put Ethereal on something else that maybe moves faster? Oh, oh shit! What does he have the mana? Uh, there it is. Ethereal. That's not right. I already had equipped. Yeah, there it is. Oh, I did forget about that the movement speed thing. Unless he doesn't have the eggshell on. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm panicking. Right, he had the shoes and the eggshell. Okay. Yes, anyway. Ah! Ah! I made it! That's all the healing I can get right now. Oh. Quest updated bullet hell forward to four. Return to follower one at the Thieves Guild. That was the door. Okay. Okay, we have been betrayed by one of our allies in a significant way. You know what that means, don't you, Burning Dog fans? Look at that, they've blocked off the Cave of the Bone. I think you do know what that means. Saddle up, lock and load. Ruin my moment like that, will ya? <laughs> 
Oh, I don't like the skulls that seem like they have teeth on top of their teeth. That should be reserved for moray eels and no one else. Where are they? They're in town, that's right. If it skulks on a reef and has two sets of teeth, that's a moray. When the jaws open wide and there's more jaws inside, that's a moray. Where am I going? Down. Oh, that's right, it's just the house. It doesn't have a logo on the outside or anything because they're illegal. meanest looking form I have. Oh, yeah, I know. No, oh, wait, now I've been set up for that. I'll just go right here, and then... Hey, so somebody tried to ditch me. Fellow guild member members, senior peon. How are you still alive? Uh, I meant to say, how wonderful it is that you are still alive. I thought you were a goner when the cave collapsed in the mines, yes! You are definitely a brave thieves guild member. Uh, here is the reward that you rightfully deserve. Oh, look at that, I get 50 experience for it. And a star. <clears throat> uh, that guy's voice was rough on my throat. Oh, listen, I'll go easy on you from now on, alright? You, you don't need to glare at me angrily like that. I can't believe even a peon like you gets work to do, but I never get assigned anything at all. I thought to myself, how do I make Follower 2 even worse? So that voice, but more. Oh, right, yeah. That's why I changed from the stairs and they're just walking in like that. Fuck yeah. Where the fuck am I going? Thank you, stranger. Sorry, must be the toxic gas in a power plant irritating my tear ducts. Oh, yes, yes. Because he's the guy who stands outside the, uh, the robot dungeon. Where am I going? Oh, yes! That's right, I wanted to go to the vampire thing because... Oh, level 36. Well, we'll take a look anyway, because I wanted to do it. <laughs> Okay, they're a bunch of levels lower than me, but, but... Just imagine how much it must suck to be one of those exploding henchmen. I had a... comment about this guy, I think. Ah, here it is, but I guess I'll wait till I get over there. Oh, sorry, I thought that would kill you. That's right, a cat got nibbled to death by a mouse. And it was a cat with magic powers and shit, too. So there are really no excuses there. Actually, I can only think of one game where you could shoot pickups. Uh, Duke Nukem 1, the original one. Oh, well, 
Fuck that guy, too. Oh, no, wait, you can't poison them, I forgot. Nope, I'm just gonna keep on doing that. There we go. Yeah, you could get health back by drinking cans of pop, but uh, if you shot one, then it would spray up into the air with, like, a fountain of uh, drink beneath it. And if you collected it in midair while it was doing that, you got a shitload of points, but no health. Here he is. Alas, I think I shall remain here, not thinking of bovines. Shout out to Elthwar, who says, I think Count Grinwald has the largest jaw out of any vampire I've ever seen. I suspect he can only drain blood in a very messy or very controlled manner. Regardless, it seems like monster home invasion is a big theme going on here. The Calamity's forces seem to prefer to manifest in the homes rather than coming in from outside, which I think is pretty interesting. The, uh, the timer has gone just now, though, so this is a pretty good time for it. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Nobody Saves the World when we head into Gr Count Grinwald's Manor. And, uh, we see if it's uh, even remotely possible for uh, someone who's one level lower. Until then, take it easy, and I'll see you later.